Carl Brunner, Deputy Secretary General of the WTO, thank you for being on WPC TV. The WTO, which I think most people have regarded as a great success, seems to be under great strain. And I do wonder whether the uh, policy of the Trump administration is somehow to clip its wings and even destroy it. Um, you are right, the WTO has been a great success for 23 years. And you're also right, we are under considerable stress. We are under danger of losing one of the elements that distinguish us as an international organization from other international organizations. We have rules and we have a dispute settlement system which helps to make sure that these rules are abided by. And we have actually been very successful for the last 23 years. The system has been used by a large variety of members. I think almost 60 members have used it in 530 cases. And uh, the um, rulings that came out of this system have been abided by the majority of the members. We have a compliance rate of over 95%, compliance in a timely fashion. And now this is under danger because at the second level, the appellate body level, we have a situation where out of seven members, only three are actually uh, filled with um, real people, yes. whereas the other four are vacant. And um, you need three people. Um, the Europeans would call them judges, the Americans would not. You need three appellate body members to rule on a case. And next year, two of the current left members will come to the end of their second term. And if we cannot fill the vacancies by then, we have a big problem. And America has the ruling interest on... America is blocking the commencement of the process to fill the vacant positions. Let me ask you a slightly different question. Um, speaking as an Englishman, if after Brexit we re revert to WTO rules, will that be an automatic disadvantage for the British economy or, or not? Clearly yes, it will be a disadvantage for the British economy because um, most of the British exports go to Europe and this is an internal market. And uh, if you uh, fall back to WTO um, regulations, British exporters will face the external customs barriers of the European Union. And just now we heard this uh, conversation with um, the representative of Airbus. I've been speaking to somebody from BMW before. There are successful British SMEs Indeed. who export to uh, the European continent and they are not used to even deal with customs bureaucracy. This is going to be, be a problem. On that rather sad note for me as an Englishman, <laughs> Mr. Brown, thank you very much indeed and good luck Pleasure. with the future. Thank, thank you. Very you. Much.